Wow. There. See that hole underneath the bridge? It's our way in. Oh, it just had to be a sewer, didn't it? It's not Uh, uh, just leave me. Uh, I can't swim anymore. Looks like we can get up from there. Hang in there, Nama. I've got some more fight in me. Can we really get to the Siryu clan HQ through this rat hole? Yeah, no doubt about it. Still, I have heard some rumors about some real weirdos shacking up here. Stay on guard. Damn it! 
喧嘩させろやチンピラフスどうぞやったーこうサッカーでギッギッサゲルレッツゴー You wanna go? That's better I'm up! Yeah! Hope this hurts! Should I open it? Got it! Okay. 
Watch this. I'm up. Let's go. Hey. Totally. It looks like we were able to sneak in. Where are we? The Seiryu clan courtyard? The chairman's room's up there, right? Yeah, no way I'd forget it. Man, that takes me back. It was just us three. First time we came here. Whoa, hey! The hell do you come from? Uh-oh. So much for getting nostalgic, huh? Right. Guess it's a fight, then. Now let's rock and roll! Adachi san, Namba! The battle is on! Ass kicking time! Brace yourself! Yeah! Take your best shot! I'm up! You're weak! Another day. Let's get it done! Let's get it done! Hell of a scrap back there. Safe to say, they'll be hounding us. That just means we don't gotta sneak around anymore. We're going all the way to the top. Fun with 
Should I open it? Sweet!
in here. Nobody sneaks into Seryu HQ and gets away with it. You three are dead meat! Damn it. German's room's right there, too. Shit. What's the plan, Ichiban? This guy's on a good one. <laughs> He's just what we wanted. After all, every dungeon needs a tough boss at the end. Ten Not a loser! Yeah. Let's take go. <clears throat> Have fun with this. Anything works. Awesome little boys, you did. And pick it time. <clears throat> Open one. I got it. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's go. Watch this! Let's get it done! Brace yourself! Crush you! This I'm up! Going in! No mercy! Yeah! Have fun with this! Open one. This. 
Chairman's just passed here, yeah? Yeah. Stay on your toes. All right. We'll see that it's settled before next week's meeting. Precisely. We'll accept their proposal. Is that all? Very well. I'll be in touch. <clears throat> My apologies. I had to see that through. I've been managing things in Chairman Takabe's absence. I am Ebida, the clan captain. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ichiban Kasuga-san. So what? You hear about us from Takabe or something? Yes. I've heard a great deal, too. And Takabe? He's still locked up, right? In short, one of ours got busted and the chairman took the brunt of it. He's set to be released in two years. And what about you? You're filling in for him while he's away, right? I don't remember seeing you around before. I'm a new addition. I didn't join the Seiryu until after the Great Dissolution. And you're already captain? You sure climbed the ladder fast. Based on that, you must be pretty good. You flatter me. But you see, with the death of the previous chairman and the chaos that followed the Great Dissolution, well, the fact of the matter is we were short-handed. To be even more blunt about it, my promotion was based entirely on how well I earned. As a Yakuza, however, that's not really something to be proud of. Hey, you're humble, at least. <laughs> Let's get back on topic. Chairman Takabe told me what you did for the Serio clan, among others. The Ejin Three are all very much indebted to you. Please excuse me for not reaching out sooner. Yeah, appreciate you rolling out the red carpet. We take security matters quite seriously here. Unless I give explicit permission, any intruders are to be eliminated on sight. Unfortunately, it seems there was a delay in giving orders, even after I'd confirmed it was you. you maybe relax your grip on the place then, huh? One wrong move and we'd be feeding the fish right now. Huh. If I told my men to stand down first thing, I would never have seen our heroes of Yokohama in action. As acting head of the Seryu clan, it's my responsibility to determine who we do business with. Surely you understand. Well, I guess we're the ones who barged in. Wouldn't be right for us to complain about it. <laughs> you have my thanks. Anyway, ebina -san, the reason we came here... Yes, I'm aware. It's about Sasaki-san. Is that right? <laughs> that certainly saves us some time. Where do you think we're headed? Maybe the mountains? You know, so they can bury us in the woods? Far from it. We're en route to a warehouse at the wharf. And we gotta go all the way to the harbor just to talk about Sasaki? Well, seeing is believing, as they often say. After the Great Dissolution four years ago, even some Seryu clan members were ready to leave the Yakuza life behind. Chairman Takabe, in light of this, encourage them to do just that. However, one major obstacle stands between an ex-Yakuza and the outside world. The five-year ex-Yakuza clause, right? 
Uh, correct. As long as that's in place, former Yakuza are unlikely to find decent work, forcing many onto the streets. Knowing what might await them, the first thing the chairman did was provide a way one might make an honest living. And what's that? You'll see. In fact, we're almost there. We bought the warehouse the Liu Mang had been using some time ago. It's here we gather trash from all four corners of the globe. Trash? I say trash, but in reality, it's a little more complicated than that. Rather, it's things one can no longer afford to keep. For example, we might receive evidence of a president's adultery or illicit money transfer records. A scholar may call them pieces of history, but to others, they are cursed objects meant to be destroyed. As to our part, we secretly store these controversial trinkets for safekeeping. And should the client request it, we'll dispose of their trash without hesitation. It's our duty to make clients feel safe, that they might entrust their disposables to this island nation we call Japan. So, it's like a giant safety deposit box. Precisely. Each storage container is lined with lead, so even x-rays can't make out their contents. In addition, the interiors are also vacuum sealed to prevent degradation. Naturally, that demands a rather high premium, but we still find ourselves with new inventory almost every day. I swear, what'll you Yakuza think up next? Oh, this isn't just some Seryu clan racket. It's our front corporation. Right, so this is where you're sending those who want out? Yes. The Omi and Tojo's dissolution changed everything. Many Yakuza who are unable to reintegrate into society have since returned. Not everyone can weather those five long years. And thus, the Yakuza is all they have. Whatever their reasons, it's estimated they number over 10,000. There's still that many? Far as they're concerned, the best option is to side with smaller local groups like the Seryu clan. Provided at least one organization remains, they will no doubt continue to seek them out. For this reason, Chairman Takabe plans to coordinate with all remaining Yakuza clans and quickly dissolve them as well. What? You mean all at once? The Yomei Alliance of Hiroshima, the Kitikata family of Hokkaido, the Ryudo family of Okinawa. Those are just the start as he's secretly in touch with many other groups as well. He's aptly called this plan the Second Great Dissolution. Should it succeed, then the Yakuza will truly be a thing of the past. I have been acting on his behalf, carefully advancing the plan while he's away. Never knew Takabe had his sights set so high. In order to avoid the hardship caused by the first dissolution, the second will only be carried out once we've secured enough jobs. To that end, we've been expanding our business in numerous areas. Frankly, not all of them have been successful, but we can't afford to let that slow us down. We must give all we have to the task at hand. So the second great dissolution. When exactly are you guys planning to pull the trigger? when the time is right. That's all I can say for now. You've told us so much already, even though we just met. Seriously, it means a lot. Kasuga-san, Adachi-san, I'm well aware of all the work you two have done in rehabilitating former Yakuza. That said, I am also aware of your current predicament. 
Uh. Despite this, let me assure you that our goals are the same. Masumi Arakawa's last wish. His incredible dream of giving every last Yakuza a chance at normal life. Would you entrust that to us? Kasuga-san, Adachi-san. Sasaki! Guess you really were here after all, huh? Uh, I'm sorry, I, uh... <laughs> well, uh, to be honest, I came here with the intent of joining the Seiryu clan. Uh, but thankfully, Ebina-san said I could stay a civilian. You've got nothing to apologize for. If you're okay with this, then you have my support. We will take responsibility and look after Sasaki-san from here on. Is that all right with you? Honestly, it's amazing what you guys have done. Makes me wonder why I even bother trying to do it on my own. Anyway, Abina-san, I ultimately just want to say thank you. This might sound kind of presumptuous of me, but... If I may, could I ask you see this through? That no man gets left behind? Yes, of course. I'll see that it's done. Kazuka-san. Hmm? Provided you still have time, there's someone I'd like you to see. Yeah? I mean, sure. I've got nothing but time right now. Glad to hear it. In that case, allow me to give him a call. That won't be necessary. <laughs> well then, it would appear he's already here. Hmm? No way. It's been a while, Ichi. Holy shit. Captain Sawashiro. Hmm. 